I'm so happy to see you. My name is Dr. Kassiri Alan Musanyusa. By the grace of God, I'm also a minister who serves the living Jesus Christ. I no longer serve the devil as I used it to. I want to thank the Lord. For he took me there for a reason. There is something he spoke, I was meditating upon it this morning. I was remembering my mother telling me, It was about eight years, I was still young. I was in P2 second term. They had just put me in primary two. My mother sent for me. She was about to die. Just like a, an eight year old child, you do not know so much about death. But my mother was, the hair was getting blacked off. But truly, I didn't know what was happening. Such to her. I didn't understand it. I just grew, I first grew up. And I understood that it was HIV AIDS. Now the other old HIV could black off people's hairs. However much you could plait your hair, you couldn't tie your hair. For it used to pluck itself. Up. I remember as we seated on the veranda where mommy was, I was brought using a bicycle. It was called Hero. Hero, 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 something. Hero, something like that. Yes. My elder brother rode me to my mother. I found when they had laid uh, I never knew it was called a back cloth. She was laid on a back cloth. He told me, my son, please come and sit with me. I want to speak to you. In her weakness, she lift up her head and put it on my laps. So I was carrying her while she was sleeping. So she started narrating to me the story of my life. the story of my life. She told me that she gave birth to eight Yes. went to which doctor so that they can get but me I cannot leave this world when I have not told you how I got you she told me when I went to a witch doctor and the he told her that the child you're going to give birth to you have a very big work you're going to do in the century therefore I, have to, I had to grow up in a family which was well off so me I never knew what it meant I was just starting to to, to study. I just studied for about one or two months. Before I jumped primary one, then went to primary two. When mom told me like that, and she spoke so many words, and she kept quiet as though she was tired. Yet she had gone off. Me, I also didn't know the things of dying. So I called Uncle Balaba. Mom is sleeping. She's no longer narrating to me. Never did I know that she has died. When she died, they gathered her up, 
and they started crying. Me, I didn't cry because I didn't know. I saw people crying as you know the whole story. COVID-2021. In the year of 2021 COVID season, that second COVID. Tata Wang, my father, Najarwala, got sick. She was taken to Masaka Hospital. And they treated. They treated. Now, my elder, who was the leader of the. Called me and said, Go and fetch on father. And you bring him. The doctor has already prepared for him. When I go to Masaka Hospital, I told them I have come for father to take him to hospital. They told me the situation cannot permit him to use a private car unless you use an ambulance. They called Kampala and they sent an ambulance for us. I reached my father in the hospital. We put him in the Heart Institute. In that, that is where we have some little authority. Now, because my in law is the head of the Heart Institute in Mulago, COVID in Atabuka. COVID wasn't. So they started bringing COVID people. And they told us, please let us vaccinate this gentleman. And they vaccinated him. But now what about you people who are treating him? May I refuse to be vaccinated? Because I knew a lot. He who knows a lot will be asked a lot. It was Monday. And they told us, rush Muzei COVID. For you who are taking care of him, you're going to get sick of COVID. We took Muzei from there. And we took him. And took him to the doctor's place. At home. So, Mommy Tom had called me. When she told me I had to pray for the prayer warriors of the prayer warriors, but they, had, they couldn't have they did not allow any means of transport. You remember that season? So when I spoke about the so many mysteries that were deep, they wanted to close off Mutundwe. And they said Mutundwe collect gathers people, yet there is COVID. And the police was becoming so worse. And I told them one of the mysteries that I'm going to speak in the Nayos prayers today. And I told them, but fear not. So Mami Tom told me don't go now. These things people need to hear them. There are things that you don't speak to all people. So I spoke them the next day. So all my brothers ran away from Muzei. And also me after ministry I had no ministry which where I was. And I told them let me come the next morrow. And the, and the next day I woke up so very early and met Muzei alone. As we were going to sleep in the night 
Ndine muzei mulumu babiri. We were together with muzei in this. Net doctor ne family ye bali wagulu elie wabu. And the doctor with, with the family in the other upper room flat. Nga ku enkera ye satu juni. The next day was third June. Matters day. Matters day. Nga doctor ya 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 tese tese emisa ya abwe. When the doctor had organized their service. Iranga ba yise father agenda kujia kusoma misa. And they called the reverend father to take on the service. Katie chiro. Now the night. Muzei na nyumiza kukaboz. My muzei told me a story. Kenali siwuli rangako. That I'd never heard of. Nangaba mwana wangu bade wabie unyo. Told me my son you've been so mysterious. Era nali nkwe ganyi. And I had denounced you. Kuwebi intubiozize oko lambulamu. For the things you've been doing in your life. Na hina gambi buwa. But I was told that you're going to work, to work in a century. But I never understood it. Today I am blessed. Do you know what your father is telling you that you're blessed? I am too spiritual. But I didn't understand him. Because I am in your hands. After Mzei spoke that, Chirwana Mark Africa, Africa Chirwana called me. Nambuza yeba nai, Mzei wa muatu zobu lo kozi. And asked me, have you made Mzei confess salvation? Lumu tujirimba meka? We are two people in the room. He has just hmm? told me I've been so mysterious, but and I work to I have to work. So many things he spoke there. And he said, Look, behold, here I am in your hands. When Chirwana spoke like that, and I, said, and I said, Papa, it is you who prays for me a prayer. He speaks a prayer in his Catholicism. And I said, Amen, because he's my parent. I no longer make those signs, but I say, Amen. But I said, this time, Father, Father, it is me who is going to pray for you. It is you who pray for me. Yogera but what I speak is what oh, you speak. Do you see the spirit of counsel? And I made my father confess salvation in much wisdom not knowing that the next day he is leaving. After, after preaching to him, then we confess the prayer. And we finished. And he kept quiet. And I said, Amen. He said, Amen. So in, in the night, he was so much disturbed. The next day, I shaved off his beards and gave him a tablet. And he said, he told me, do you remember the words I told you in the night? He said, Father, I remember all. But he said, you were to work in a century. Kati. After dressing him so well, I put him in the wheelchair. I told him, let me take you to the service. Because the doctors had already sat and he was needed. And I said, asked him, am I going to, to be in the service? Which, which service is that for the matters? Then he said, I rolled him off the chair. Said, I got hold of his hand and the other side. Look how mighty God is. Father ja. The father comes. Doctor, doctor tells him, But first anoint this gentleman. Father Nagamba, I come, my lady, is a and the father said, let me first get done with the service. I'll anoint him. 
Do you hear how God Yet I'd already made him confess to what we miss our kati. As in the middle of the service, we are seated listening to everything going on. And Papa just shook off the hand. Holding with this hand and the sister holding the other hand. And he said, Zaina again. And he went off. Pakati. Now. As we are discussing with my sister yesterday. And he said, do you know that in our family we have something special we cannot understand? And I told him, why? She brings out a secret. We were told that you have to work and you have the wealth of this family. But you got saved. You have some special way that you understand. Now today I was remembering and pondering about those words. And I remember that these men were organizing. When I was being trained. They looked for me and they wanted someone to work in the 21st century. So for them they thought they wanted someone who was going to work for the devil. Now in the year 2000. I've done every training for 20 years. I was so expert in everything. In the spiritual, I was too deep. Too deep. 2000. Year 2000. 2001. 2001. 2002. I was very talented and I was a problem in Uganda. 2003. In 2003, the, the month of May, it was 30 years. God, in His own wisdom, made me, me thinking I had gone to work. Yeah. Amen. And he encountered me. But one of the reasons was because he knew I had one of the secret seated in church. And he used Roger Mugisha through his testimony. And he spoke and said, I was serving the devil for 10 years. Remember me who was his helper and yeah. taken 20 years. ten years. For him is 10 years. Hmm? Yes. And he said, I was born with a triple six mark. My, my and yet we had to use that power in this 21st century and he said it is not only me, but even that boy seated over there so today it has been disturbing my head. And he said God is not familiar. The devil prepared someone who is going to work in this And God in the very center he And got me out to start speaking of the mysteries that are It goes me to cry and I said we need not to familiarize God. And therefore you may be having things that you're going through yet you don't know their origin. I so much beseech you go back and be truth the Holy Spirit. For some of us never knew the Holy Spirit. We just knew that the devil is our father. We never knew that there was God who 
who created the devil kati mumbere fana na bwetu so in such a situation nze nafuna omukisa ne mfuna omuntu ambulira kubikwata kubulamu bwange i got a chance and got some me about my life. The question is, do you know the origin or the beginning of your life up to now? There must be something disturbing. Yet you do not know where it is coming from. For me, it has helped me quicken my journey to break through and get somewhere. For I know the background of my life. Hello? Hello? So in the background of my life, there are things we used to do it was only to deter all Christians and we make them perverted. We got their spots. We got their minds. So that we could divert it. So that we could divert it. We never allowed anyone to be holy. So some things have been happening while I was speaking. Yet the churches I was speaking those words are not ready for the people that the Lord entrusted with them to help those people reach heaven. People only came, people only came to the church Alan Kassiri was the servant of the devil. Now, what you speak? They are just hovering about the world. After they leave. Now this is a great warning ministry. May not be everywhere or anywhere. But it necessitates you who are seated here to know what is taking place in the world. We do not need a very big army. We need a few people who can stand and they say the world looks like this. This is what we see. There are people who organized it to be like this. That it will help us so that we avoid it and we don't entangle ourselves into it. Today, I want to speak of two things. Those that deter us you remember we are in early days, last days in the spiritual battle. That's why That is why I will move slowly. Amen. That you may understand what I am saying. Two things. We know how we can behave. For that is how we are. Because we are in the battle of worship between us and the devil. The devil does not permit us. And yet God created us for worship. That is why you see the thing that deters from getting to God is what I want us to speak about. One. We want to ask ourselves what slays ministers of God and they completely fall when someone does not have any element of the fear of the Lord when we look critically if it is singers I have spoken so many times if it is preachers they have a scripture that says touch not. 
And we forget Mama the work of the elders of the church. Mom, I want to thank you. Thank you for coming every other day. I want God in these remaining days of the world that He may marry you. We see something joking. We see something joking. But at your age, when you sit and speak to Pastor Musumba Moses. He gives you ample time and listens to you because of the edge. And he says that you Amen. And therefore, do not get worried. And please tell the children, please sit. For it is written to speak to them. Because you have an elder in church as the elder in church. and maybe an apostle. You can tell on the pastor even if he's getting it. That is the scripture and gives you permission. So these words you are speaking. Some people take it as jealousy. You know? They take them so lightly and they're like, ah. But true words are very bitter. I do not know whether you can fornicate or commit adultery and you tell your wife. Truthfully, Truthfully you committed adultery. Truthfully, you committed an adultery and you have to tell her and you won't go back. But you fear to speak the truth and something eats you up. Perhaps you would have told her, help me out and we'll pray over this. My question comes to you. I am asking. Do you think, what do you think that has caused it a very big problem and ministers of the Lord to be completely completely backsliding or falling off what do you think you know these services are not normal for truth be told, many have been baptized. Even Pastor so and so, no. Perhaps we should have stood. And Minister so and so, no. And someone feels the weakness. And some people have gone to the level of quitting completely and leaving salvation. I won't say so and so. I'll take a general question. For it is they that make a very great work. It is them that open and God speaks. The I want to ask what do you think the problem is? Help me. When you sit there, what do you think causes the problem because you are so a I'm not talking about only pastors, only intercessors. Do you know a church that has intercessors? In they are no longer be seen. Someone prayed to a level. When you take them to your prayer, so and so saw me and is going to marry me. Start fighting it. They start fighting it. How do, they, how do they take you before they take me? The Are you called to minister in that? Or? What do you think is the cause? Amen.
Holy Spirit. She's saying, if you're not filled with the Holy Spirit, Pastor. It was Every day. Wow. For it is a point that has been brought up. For it is the Bible no that the Holy Spirit Put fear over you if you're going to do something evil. Let me ask, do people know the Holy Spirit? You seated over there, do you know the Holy Spirit? For he is one of those that help you to connect to heaven. Do you think, what do you think is something else that has made ministers backslide? Amalala. Right. Ha. Mama nyav. Ha. Mhm. Gatao. Wanji. Senti. Ho. Senti. Mamon. Omoyo gwa mamon. The spirit of mamon. Tutunulira amalala. We are looking at pride. Senti. Money. Yena limba bulideko. Uh, Satan ya mani gaina kusente Powers Zakosa Na zogera koko The devil has over money eh. Moza ni nabi njibye suogera anga Ay 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 Oh sente Money Noza tedi atayagala sente wana There is no one here who doesn't want money Hmm Ne mwuzi kiri ze chino nchigazi yeko luna kuruencha But let me expound on Eche this tomorrow sente. That issue of money Eh Kuvange nchia luna kuruwabachi so tomorrow is the, it is the day of work. Every worker works to get money. Remind me tomorrow. Let me tell you what do you think? Independence. Being independent. Ah. You're, you're independent. Everything it is about you. Let me give you this. Whichever false prophet does not give out a pulpit. Do you know that? preaches from January to December for he has to give people that and people eat one type of food only one type of food nothing else And these pastors that call us to come in such services, you, you must search out so where they grew up the food they they came came them, for they knew that the person does not grow with only one type of food. Therefore, there are nine demon dark angels. They are called Ba malaika abechizikiza muenda. muenda. Bano satani beba mukolere emirimo. These ones work for the devil. Bino byo nabyo uli da malala. All these things you've had the pride, sente, the money, byo uli de. Those things you've had. Kakat. Now. Ngenda kuba kumenyera speed. I am going to break them down. Nkunyonyole koko and I explain a little. Abatono. A few. Soka, the first one, the angel of marriage, the angel of darkness of marriage, the second one, of the children, children, ministry number Satan That is the full ministry that devil has caught in his hands. 
school teachers or children ministers. Mukari, not to see Zobaka. Wali wo Malaika Mulambo Mulimo Guacola, Guacurumba, there is a full, a full angel of darkness. His era ya called him the vital season ya later. Buricho would catch a chichi to Ramuvana. Everything you hear that sits in the children, Mulimo Guacola, that is the work he does. Catin Waba, we be a business, and there is that angel of darkness of business. Everything concerning work. Their duty is to do every folly and disorganize people's works. That one of there is that one of the gospel. Bano stera kubamba ni nokuwa tulira. I normally speak that in the intercessors. The one of the children. The one of the prayer intercessors. This is that one that holds all concerned with the intercessors. His duty is not to allow you to be connected in to be connected to and yet it is you opens up the heaven and closes it hello amen there is that angel of darkness concerning music that one is duty he can never allow you you have the talent. He cannot permit you that you can take the children of God to his throne. There is one one of the governance. Those ones feed on blood. Their duty is to cause that it is they that feed blood to all that blood suckers. So these people, if you are a prayer warrior, they are the ones that need to be attacked in every sector. You cancel every duty and every work they do. Therefore, because I was deeper in music, I want to talk about that bafferment of music. He is sacrificed. He is a blood sucker. He has done everything you can think of that will make you move in unrighteousness and unholiness. So the problem we have especially in church for us hey. to think the one of the number fashion and design yes fashion and design listen remember we co-work according to different missions one music. The one of music. The problem with our gospel musicians we have. So I'm according to experience. I'm speaking according to experience. One of the problems we have, we do not know what we have. That what we have. What is what is called? Poto. It is what makes a portal eh? where the Lord is going to pass to come down. Do password. So it is you that has that password. It is you that can open up that portal of heaven. And if you deeply worship, 
When the word comes from the throne, it only has to open. For because there is nothing else that can do it. But because this guy knows it, what was given to him is to disorganize every person called a worshiper. I told you last time about the sinners and what they go through. I want to first ask you today which gospel musician do we have that you can boast about so they can cast to the throne of God. Who do you know? Who do you know? Do you know that a nyimba is in Kenya? In Kenya, are more powerful than secular music. And I heard Osinachi. Yes, I came to Uganda. I think it's September. He's coming to Uganda in about September. The musicians like Adan, so many. But here in Uganda, I request you to ask, which musician can we take to an international level that can help us and bring just the God of Uganda into those people and they also hear him? Who do we have? I want to ask you what came over us. What do you think the cause is? My sister talked about the price. One talked about money. But the most important issue is called the Holy Spirit. And all of them have been talked about. Me, I want to ask you, who do we have now that we can cling on and say at least this one? This will be like Pastor Nabosa. Hmm? Why has she fellowships from is also another mess. For so the, the lead pastor does not want to listen. Does not want to listen to any pastor. And if I talk about you, you may feel a lot of sorrow. But who should we look at? So I want to ask where did these singers go? Where is Betty Nachibuka? Where is she? David Boyinda. Where is David Boyinda? I am talking about the core of gospel music. Me and you have the solution. Yes. Where is Betty Namaganda? Where is George Okudi? Where are they? Do you know those people? Where is Yasini Kea? Where are they? I want to ask. Are they faded off? Even when they are dead, <laughs> they still speak. But we expect a gospel musician even when they are grown old. What do you think of it? Don what? Don more? Don more when? How old is he? How, old, how many years did he sing? Even when you make an oldies concert. So that we listen to how they sing. You also look for him. 
Nkubuza. I am asking you. Bwambale haga ya aliwa. Wiz bwambale haga ya. Chichecha wawo. What? Kusuba Moses. Chichecha wawo mwana wange. Abantu wana batu kwata. Nibatu kwata. Bana kambuze. Let me ask. Waluwa kwa ye singo kunu menyo. There's a choir that hurts me a lot. Chosen harvest. Where is chosen harvesters? Who used to sing in heaven forever? What is happening now? Where are they? I not, don't want to listen to but you. But there is something we are going to do me and you. So that we can stand. Judith Babidi Aliwa. Where is Judith Babidi? Kambuze. Let me ask you. Do you think Bugembe's music can take you to the throne of God? Me, I am talking about a person who got the Rema word from God. Yesterday, Yesterday, children brought me a song as if I was not in Uganda. Katonda wabana ku, eh? Katonda wabana ku akola. So, me, I have no So, if you bring me no that even so and so as how can I? Perhaps you may say I'm so bad. And ask. Kakati tuli mugan katonda wabana kwa kola. Ona ale mebda no mulo kola. He has even failed to save this one. Gongani na yamu yamba aliburunji. Really? You tell me he's also well off. Biruma. It hurts. Ninga tebi tuli mo. Yet it is what we have. This is what we are going to do. I am going to leave off some minutes. We are going to pray to rescue and redeem the souls of our brethren. All the Julie Mutesasera. Do you know the woman called Naki Julie? Naki Julie. Why you to yagala amali rize kuyimba? If she sings, you don't want her to stop. But those demons, everyone, if you touch them, if the money and all the problems the musicians have are all entangled in relationship, in relationship, what we call in song as Amaka. That is why our sister said that what is the problem is called the Holy Spirit. If you go around all of them, they got fed up of poverty. They got the got fed up of poverty. for money in whichever way. When I listen, when I talk about Mike Holly, I want to cry. Hello? Hello? So I'm going to talk about one who is so annoying, annoying because he has the next topic. Exodus. 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 Africa is one gospel. He is the lead gospel artist in Africa. But he's a musician who doesn't He drinks and goes off. But he tells you, I am a servant of Jesus. But remember all these music, music, music songs are targeting the youth. 
So I want to warn you. If you hear or you feel if you, listen, if you listen to a song of a person who is completely backslidden, they no longer sing those spiritual songs. Please, first put a hole so that you help yourself be connected. Am I understood? We put in a flash and eh? that it will help you in your house. Those old songs are there. Yes. They will help us. That it will keep us. That we shall be connected with God. But nowadays. Wanji? Nowadays, things are bizarre. They are fighting. They do not want you to reach where you're supposed to. The singer I'm talking about, Exodus, after when he sings, he does a song. So he brings the dance strokes. Me I had not taken care of him. Whatever is being, I had not minded of whatever I was doing. And he brought dance strokes that worship the devil. And these dance strokes are in his video. That snake style that is done in that dance. Song. That song that was done in the desert. And I remember the dance strokes we did prepared is to worship the former master. When I started singing the dance strokes, I was wondering, is it what the boy had uh, go to church? So I started making a flashback in every church that I've gone to. And I started looking at the dance strokes on the past. And I started looking at at them, where are they? For the devil, after doing his work, you do not know where he is gone. If you fulfill his mission, so now those dance strokes are escorted by the dress code. So every dance stroke has a dress code. So in the deeper battle we have is this pulpit. This pulpit. This pulpit. We do not know it. Mom and dad for the worship team. Let us not play over this pulpit. It has caused us to draw away God. And it is yet where he descends. Listen to what is going on. Exodus 20. Exodus 20 24 and 20 We are on the dress code The dance Where the worshippers We are going to get them out We won't get worried So let us be So let us be So let us be Mm. 
mentezo mm. guli wantu we njijukiriza ange nyali yange ndi <laughs> jajoli nange mm. ndikuwa omukisa soko komekao ouli abagamba you hear how it says nkolere choto changi make me an altar echetaka of the earth ouli de kujukwelanga ye biwe bwayo byange ebyo chebwa na buli chintu chonna nanga owenje okukiranga okay kuwo muchi and i'll bless you naye ulira bwagamba wansi to what it says in the next verse mhm mm era buli nkolere ekyoto ekya mayinja aha to kizimbi anga mayinja agatemebwa aha kubanga buli mm. chimu sako ekyu macho aha ngo kiretedde Ugwagwa. Oh, Wanji? Yeah. Kati atandi so kuogera kuchichi? Now he has started talking about the altar. Kwe tugendo kuyimirira. Where we are going to speak. Hayagala kubugwagwa. He does not want to profane it. Mamu wa worship team. Director wa worship team bangambi liru wali. Aliru dao. Uno. Aliwa? Wali. Aha. Mama tusanyi sokura. We are happy to see you. Let all others receive. You see sin You see sin Let us be an example. Let them tell you that you, put on, you put on whichever. You put on that dress code. For this place. Wano. Here. Eh? Here. Let us wait to see the folks have done their blessing. Let us see how we will not descend and bless wow. us. Please be very key on the dress code. Here the practice. Whenever we are done with practice, through the costume designer, you will tell us we are going to dress like this. That is how why the Holy Spirit must sit on you. For so it is he that will choose for us to so time we are raise our hands you will not make someone stumble so you have very big reason I don't want you to bring listen to what is saying so to linyanga kuchoto changi kumadala uleme okukuna mirako Are you seeing these steps? Okay. If I'm putting on a short dress, eh? Or not, if I'm to make a step, I must pull it. Or if I'm to make a I must pull it. Or perhaps I must. Now the person on the other side The mindset is very first look at your thigh Before they look at So perhaps you have already completed the By the time you reach here He has undressed you He has put you on his bed you hear, you hear raising up the oh, hands saying that, that girl. Kakati. Now. When they see that short dresses will work for them. Do you know what we can do? So next, next week we are going to put on pants. So that we do not... But because the Bible says we ladies let us not dress with the name Who knows where that scripture is? Deuteronomy 20. Deuteronomy 22.5 Echa mateka wukubiri Sula abiri mubiri Onyuru kutano Omukazi Tayamba langa chama sajja 
sono musajja tayambalanga chambalo cha mukazi mm. kubanga akola ebi wa muzizo mm. ili mukama katonda wo we komerao stop there tulina ne nkole gamba we have a working that says katwambale ndaba batu koledde za kisajja za designer mm. ya designing ze empale tulaba za kikazi the, the panties are women a ladies kakati njagala kuba za yoko anyi mugenze ko makanisa agenja so i want to take you back to the different churches waliola biye kaba ananga bayamba de ne bambalo obupale ne bayinya wane kibera wane have you ever seen kubanga bagenda ko kunkumula mazina when the girls have dressed with panties and they stand on the pulpit era njagala kubuza and i want to ask you amakanisa agali bwega to gali nazi worship team such churches had big worship teams na ye galigati akati but how are they now bino bire mu bible katonda ya nyumba things are biblical it is god that speaks them kakati now fetu abikolanga tuli misiri we did those things in the world era wano nabagamba ko and here i told you nti twatandikira ku misono jango ye that we started with the fashion yetu tandikira ku mpale we started with the panties jini bazitanga lala jini we call them the lala jeans era ntera nyo gamba and i normally abasumba tell pastors abachaza abasumba abakazi ngaba ambale mpale ku chitutu those host pastor women pastors and they put on panties on the pulpit nzinchi bagamba muri kasera i tell them every day ninga gwe tomanyi chicho obokoze and i tell them you do not know what you have said abana obwongo bwa bufugibwa bakazi this man their mindset is omusajja buli watunula ku maberego whenever they look on your, about your breast na tunula they look at your thigh mu bifobyo bino in your this bless obwongo bwe bonna butandika kwambula ngoyi their mindset starts undressing you katebe twabikola tutandise design za ngoyi so we did that when he had started the fashion no muchala, nga, we used to work with a woman called Sylvia Roll kane tutandike misono je ngoyi so we started the fashion cloth fashion ne tulete empale then we brought panties jeans hizo zikapaipo jeans twasoka ne jeans zilala we started the lala zako uh, bukachupa yes those one kane those zako legging we started the broad kane tulete empale bajita kasumbusa so brought it wojambale kukwata wete we na bring it when you put on that one it shows your entirety generation yenu remember this generation eye cha sacha ama 12 mu chimu of the 21st century e yagala nyo kulaga chiri na wo want to so much show what they have ndio lino kulaga omubiri you have to show your body mwana gwe nkubulire wo bwala ali wano na i tell you woman here musinza gwe nawe nkubulire you worship here Buli boli nyaka tundi ngo yamba do kwesitaza abalabi whenever you get the bomb mazo ko bawo katunda tagenda kujewa he won't come here gwe buli boga mba kansi beka gundi ngiro mubiri balage ko that tight clothes to Ate show mwana watu joyongero kudiba the more you fed off kubanga because ba yamba devichi kati ataba lenzi balaba era baulira now the boys the men are seeing and they are listening ere kivamwa we wayamba lidatyo na iwe mnamu tuuseka kulaba yamba dati ali mu church if he is putting on like that kivamwa gara lenzi gamu no bagaba kitegala ba banange galaba you only saying boys of the church balaba yeri bagoba but what they are seeing is what churches them yamba na burunjo bere decent put on decently wanje put on decently omuntu agenda kulabira that you will dala muwerezo omukuru the person will see that you really ngatoli na gwe wesi taza when you have not stumbled anyone na yabana bazina nga amazina but children used to dance wanje they used to have ata abana baso ko kuzina amazina wana bali bajojo okudi and those children started with jojo jojo okudi atandike ebyo kwambala empala abawala ne batandike okwa ntibo obolo zina amazina nnyinyo kwefumula Olino kwambala chi you dancing with the strength you have to Chava put it down to the so it ate up all the churches so it ate up all the churches buri kanisa je waliyo manyiti ya amani every church that you knew was strong ebizibwe ebizituseko the problems that have affected them kubanga katonda wano yavao because the lord left era yensonga lwachi reason why abawereza bakatonda the ministers of god stani abangu idemangu nyo 
wamba. The devil has taken them off so fast. Kubanga shelter bachito urugo eh? Urugo. Urugo terucha aliwo wanu. Because there is no hedge. Ora makatonda ya yamba zani Adam ne Eve anga bako zensobi. If the Lord rest Adam and Eve when they had made. Muju kireri mu rubereberie. Do you remember in Genesis? Whenever they understood that they realized they made a mistake, when they got the leaves, they only cover these parts. When he came, he dressed them the entire body. These things are holy. But the dress code on the pulpit, I beseech you, mommy. I don't know how you do things here. But so many churches have fallen. That's why the worship team worship team does a lot of things. Take the children of God to the throne. And does a lot of things. Take people to the hell. Praise the Lord. Kukungu baga. Lamentations. Kukungu baga tano kumina tano egambetia. Lamentations 5.15. Agamend esanyu liyo mutima gwa feriko mie. Aha. Okuzina kwa feku fuse okuubara. Hey. Abantu abazenga bazze kusanyuka. People who came to enjoy. Amazina getuba tera wano. The dance strokes we put for them. Gabale tera enyike mu mitima jabu ina vijuga. Brings a lot of sorrow in their hearts. Watch out to dance go where is that one. Please. Watch out for I beseech you. Leave these things of looking for a trainer. I am a trainer. Yesterday our children were ministering. The, one of the girls was very sensitive. They called some children from some church. They call them that themselves that funny name. Children came. They danced. Our children looked. So when we reached a time of calling our children to minister, our strokes are very simple. In dance, we have what we put the song the way it moves. Whatever, whatever the song speaks is what the gesture does. So the dance strokes of gesture. No. Because what you speak is what you do. What, what they do. But more comfortable. In a way that, can, that can not make sense. They are putting on the They are long black skirts. They are covering. 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 So my daughter is very sensitive. Because they were dancing looks was sim, 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 sim. was sim. Kakati, omu kubaba deva zina wali. Ya waso so kuzina. One of the other dancers. No zanga wa sekerera. But they're laughing at them. So after everything, I asked her joy. Today what? What did you enjoy? There are people that dance. They were laughing at us. Seeing our dance strokes are not like Why were they laughing at us? 
Then I asked, did you enjoy their dance strokes? They were dancing like those dance strokes of the devil on TV. We think children don't know. So we also come here and dance. The way we are dressed. So the dance strokes start causing people to Because we get a trainer who trained us. Training music. Me, I train music in school. Training a dance. I train dance strokes. Ira masomero gansa sulira dala sente nina ono manyina ze praise akubando za ye no mkwano ga nze training a masomero gi it is me who trains her schools me for to ka you encore production musical production i make musical productions si sobola kukukiriza kubanga bwe tutakole biri christian bigenda kuyamba balala because if we do not do already tujja kubanga bo Others we will ensi like chi for the world it has up ya tulia mukama yeba zibu amina amen ulira katonda bwa yogera ku kwambala kuva esula 28:2 what god speaks about a dress code Ulire mwe baweleza mwe. Soma 28 munana, 2 mpaka nya speed. Tuduke kwa asatu mwemu, 10 ne 10 nemu. Tuduke kwa asatu mu 5. Wona kuvao. Okuvao mu munana. Eh, kati oliyokola be katonda bwayogera ku nyambala na chiche yetaga. Olwo kubire. Mm. Era oli mukolera aloni muganda wo echamba mm. ebyambalo ebitukuvu, mm. obwe chitiwa no lwo bulunji. Genda maso. Eroli gamba bonna bali no mutima ogwa magezi. Mhm. Ne bajizo ne benajizo omuyo ogwa magezi. Mm. Bakole byambalo bya Aroni okumutukuza. Mm. Ampereze mu bwaka bona. Mhm. Bino bye byambalo bibali kola. Mhm. Ekyo mukifuba mm -hmm. ne kanzu no munagiro mm -hmm. ne kizibawo ekyakatimba mm -hmm. ekiremba mm -hmm. no lukoba. Mm -hmm. Era bali kolele byambalo bitukuvu Aroni muganda wo. Have you heard? Katonda nevi ambala bitu alanga songa. God takes dressing. Njaga la kuvuza hicho. I want to make an question. Ngogendo kuweleza. As you going to. Walioba deko mukrozet mukrozeti yano uli dango ruana. Yambala rumi yambala. Chali chukwa deko. Trying to fight. Akambuzi mani nazi. Manga kuri muweleza. Wama mani. Walioruwa nyeko. Mukroze tiyo nguli la kimichika yamba laruno na inga guya gala kwamba laruno. Chari chiku tuseko. Has it ever happened to you? Wanji? Oma chisekera. Kubanga katonda inachaya gala kuchambale chocho gendo kwamba la. Because the Lord has something that he loves about that dress you're going to put on. Mukama yevaziwe. Praise the Lord. Gendo ulire kwa asa tumuemu. Kubanga luno luo gira kubaweleza. Yes, sura asa tumuemu oru nyiriri. Oru kumi. Ne kumi ne emu. Nebi ambalo ebi kule wovulunji, nebi ambalo ebi chukui vya aloni kabona, nebi ambalo vya abana bi, mukuereleza mubwa kabona. Mukuereleza mubwa kabona. Ebi ambalo ngapi kuzeshi? Bwe tuba tugeenda kuereleza wana tu subiro kubanga na yaba mtu moli na nomuze okera bokeze kumacha. Gokwa, utegeke, uwe rogendo kuambala, ulabi we ruli. We tunule kwa mumiro la venti ngenda. Kubanga mumira bo we tunuli do mutu watu wagendo kola chi. Because the way you look at yourself in the middle place. Asatu mutano kumina muenda gamba atia. Na abiri. Asatu mutano kumina muenda na abiri. Kumina muenda. Agambie. Nevi ambalo. Evi kolewa oburu unji. Evi okuwe rezangamu. Mwatu kufu. Evi ambalo yutu kufibia aloni kabona. Nevi ambalo yaba nabi. Ebi okuwe reza angamu mkwa kabona. E watu kufu. Wano watu kufu. This place is holy. Kakati mbega iride. There are five besitu. Banalumu. Banamu. Banayusisiruvure. Banayusisiruvure. Mbega iride. Fetu tandi. Kewe chintu echi gendo kola mu generation yen. Let us start something that will work in this generation. 
something when people are going to start talking and we have our starts we can give our dance strokes what do you say? Amen that will cause someone to be happy. You man, don't put on that tight jeans. Please don't. When we come to the pulpit, let us turn the and we turn the glory to God. As he has refused to do every folly that will bring us problems. Therefore, when I remember what we organized or prepared this is the time for me to tell you the truth is because we are in the battle of worshipping whenever a person looks at your appearance it helps them to continue or to put them down the different Fashions that Those that the Lord created. Those that create or bring up clothes. They are those whose duty is to do put on design clothes that will bring. In they have brought clothes nowadays. They're very, they're like see throughs and they no longer want you to put on petticoats. Do you have mm -hmm. petticoats? Yes. Speak the truth. Young girls no longer want to put on petticoats. They have put in a long dress. They are like Muslims. They have called When it when is it right. right. So this generation is right. so right. right. How do you Even if you do that thing that saves someone you can stand. Someone has put on a very long dress. But it is very light. Still the other side, but you can see the appearance. That is the appearance. But if you put on a petticoat, the person cannot see. So they brought you a problem. Biker. Biker. You have put on your biker, but it's as if you have not put on anything. Have you ever seen such So even if you're putting on that bike, someone can say, hey, this one, this person's appearance is like this. The Bible tells us that we want to make others stumble. The man will only get seen if he just looks and thinks. But even you, who makes others stumble. Amen. So the other problem is we have, have that pant called legging. Very long. Very long. So the body, the body is very dirty. Whatever it comes out. Through sweat. That is why we are not allowed to put on those tight pants. For the body will not bring out that dirt. So your body must be bringing out that dirt. That is, there are powers on your body, that is why you sweat. 
Do you want to ascertain? Go and bathe thoroughly. After bathing, yourself, get your white towel and you clean yourself. Ask yourself whether you're from bathing or not. Every second it is bringing excretion. So whenever you put on that tight panty, that tight gin, you're not excreting. Because you're not letting out things. Now they go back inside. Then it makes what comes out and they tell you you have tumors. Yet it is only the clothes you put on. Be careful. This altar, this part, let us give the honor that Amazina we have. Rakuno, the dance strokes here, let us honor them. Wali Amazina, their dance strokes Amarunji, that good, the dress code here, let us. You will help us. Because this one, when he spoke about the battle of worship, that is what causes the problem. There's nothing else. 